wrapped it in with a cooler and a cast net with weights. This is Thump's new home. Alrighty, welcome back to yet another video here. Today is actually not the best video. I didn't want to end up posting this video just because of, uh, it's just kind of sad. I mean, this bass was so sick. Don't worry, didn't die, did not die. I read through a lot of the comments and a lot of people were saying the pond was too small for this bass. And I, I disagree, but at the same time I do agree. This thing is massive. Like, it's over limit size. Like, I didn't need something this big. We are definitely going to catch another one, so don't even doubt that. We will get another big bass. It won't be as big just because I don't want something this big. So, with that being said, we are going to bring it to this man right here, Luke. He has a pond twice the size of this and just a little bit deeper than mine. He just recently built it. We built it a while ago, but we rebuilt it recently. We're going to bring it to his house right now. We are trying to hurry up before it gets dark here so I can get a light release into his pond for you but we're going to transfer him into a bucket stressing him out as less as we can we really do not want to stress this thing out and we're going to bring it all the way to his house which is uh which is out there in loxahatchee and we're going to hope for the best for this bass i'm doing this for a very good reason i saw your guys comments i agree at this point i i, I really don't want to do this but i, I kind of have to we will get another bass so all you that wanted this bass in this pond don't worry i'm just not going to get one as big so with that being said, we're going to net this guy out of here. Luke is filling it up with water. This water is crystal clear. Really, really clean water. And I'm going to do much more touch-ups to this pond. It is not over yet. You like that little rig right there? Power went out, so I had to run it through the house. I don't know if I said that already, but we're going to fill on these sides. We're going to get all this landscape done. We're getting another filter that's going to circulate the water much more, so there's more circulation, more aeration, all that kind of stuff. But uh, for now... What up, little guy? He's doing good. He's just chilling there. I think it's a good choice to make, though. Especially when you're helping someone out like Luke. He, he needs a good bass in his pond. Look how clear that water is. It's crazy. Dude, he's freaking huge, dude. Like, absolutely massive. Thump, you will be replaced. I'm not kidding. I think I've said this 15 times already in this video. You will be replaced. Just not as big. I don't exactly want to do this to a fish, but uh, it's for the best. And there he is. Luke just ran and got another bucket just because it's not, the water's not as high in here. But I trapped it in with a cooler and a cast net with weights. So we're just gonna fill it all the way. There we go. All right, we are at the lot right here. All right, Luke's getting there. Oh my god. All right, let's go. It's literally right here. Don't worry, guys. I didn't do anything. Look how big this is compared to mine. Put her in, put her in. It's freaking massive. The flow is insane. Much warmer. Look at the fountain coming down. Lake in the middle. All clear water. There she goes. Adios, amigo. He's freaking Gucci. High five. We're good. She's good. I want to show you guys the difference between my pond and his, just size-wise, obviously, because he has a whole entire lot. Filters, just pumping water out, just like that, straight down all this. And if you come above this, it is a pool filter running this whole entire thing right there. There's a lot of tubing and uh, PVC running this whole entire thing here. But uh, yeah, it's like a rock wall. Water just pours straight down into the water. Dude, this pond is massive. It is so much bigger than mine. It's crazy. Way, way bigger. Oh God! I almost just, almost just went straight into that. <laughs> that was close. <laughs> we'll sneak around the back right here to show you guys how his mom actually designed and made this pond. Now you can see a lot of work was put into it. This is actually sheets, like for a bed and it's just concrete. So these are sheets, just concreted, so it's actually really hard and tough. Just with a chain, with just metal, whatever way, whatever design you kind of want the flow to be. And uh, yep, it's got PVC piping the whole way through. Runs straight into here, into the filter, and uh, pumps through these. You could also turn these off, turn the levers. Just goes along that whole thing. And uh, it is a massive, massive, massive pond. So I thought this would be just a great move for Thump, especially since we can always, especially since we can always just get a new one. Ugh. Get out of there. <laughs> oh my God, there's a cat. 
There's a cat, there's a cat, there's a cat. See him? See him stalking, bro? This place is huge. Like, there's a cat in a freaking cage right there that he can obviously get out. There's, and there's just kittens. Look, look at the baby kitten. Oh my gosh. Is it? Oh my lord. Look how many cats there are. Dude, what is going on? Oh my god. What's up, guys? I'm friendly, I swear. Oh, that's my favorite one right there. Come here. No, please, please. Oh, gosh, dang it. Never mind. Oh, she's feeding them. You're my favorite. Right there. You're my favorite. Dang it. They don't like me. All right, let's get out of here. Back to the pond. Cats don't like me anymore. Thump is all good. Safe to go in Luke's pond out here in Loxahatchee. Giant ranch. Many, many, many. Huge, huge pond here. There's a huge pond here. He is in a good home now. Luke is going to take care of him. I'm going to definitely get another bass, probably about four or five pounds, not overkilling it this time. I hope you guys agree with this decision that I just made. If you guys haven't done so already, subscribe below. This is probably one of my shorter videos. I usually tend to make 10 minutes plus videos. With all this being said, until next time, I'll see you guys in that next video. Peace. Oh, gee, okay.